Your uncle's in the night's watch. What's he doing back there? Preparing for a night with your family. I've always wanted to see the wall. You're Tyrion Lannister. The Queen's brother. My greatest accomplishment. And you, you're Ned Stark's bastard, aren't you? Did I offend you? Sorry. You are the bastard, though. Lord Eddard Stark is my father. And Lady Stark is not your mother. Making you the bastard. Let me give you some advice, bastard. Never forget what you are. The rest of the world will not. Wear it like armor. And it can never be used to hurt you. What the hell do you know about being a bastard? All dwarves are bastards in their father's eyes. Better looking bitches than you're used to, Uncle. <laughs> My mother's been looking for you. She arrived for King's Landing today. Before you go, you will call on Lord and Lady Stark and offer your sympathies. What good will my sympathies do then? None. But it is expected of you. Your absence has already been noted. The boy means nothing to me. Oh, I can't stand the wailing of women. One word, and I hit you again. I'm telling Mother. Go. Tell her. But first you will get to Lord and Lady Stark, and you will fall on your knees in front of them and tell them how very sorry you are, that you are at their service and that all your prayers are with them. Do you understand? You can't. Do you understand? Prince will remember that, little lord. I hope so. If he forgets, be a good dog and remind him. Ah, time for breakfast. A nice watch is a joke to you, is it? Is that what we are, Lannister? An army of jesters in black. We don't have enough men to be an army, and aside from your in here, none of you are particularly funny. I hope we provided you with some good stories to tell when you're back in King's Landing. But something to think about while you're drinking your wine down there. Enjoying your brothels. Half the boys you've seen training will die north of the wall. Might be a wildling's axe that gets them. Might be sickness. Might just be the cold. They die in pain. And they do it. So plump little lords like you can enjoy their summer afternoons in peace and comfort. Do you think I'm plump? Listen, Benjamin, may I call you Benjamin? Call me what you like. I'm not sure what I've done to offend you. I have great admiration for the Night's Watch. I have great admiration for you as First Ranger. <laughs> you know, my brother once told me that nothing someone says before the word but really counts. But I don't believe that giants and ghouls and white walkers are lurking beyond the wall. I believe that the only difference between us and the wildlings is that when that wall went up, our ancestors happened to live on the right side of it.
How would you like to be rich? Dwarf man still making noise. My family is rich. We have gold, lots of gold. I'm prepared to give you lots of gold. In... Now go! Well, I don't have it here. Now go! Fuck off. Where do I begin, my lords and ladies? I am a vile man. I confess it. My crimes and sins are beyond counting. I have lied and cheated, gambled and whored. I'm not particularly good at violence, but I'm good at convincing others to do violence for me. You want specifics, I suppose. When I was seven, I saw a servant girl bathing in the river. I stole her robe. And she was forced to return to the castle naked and in tears. If I closed my eyes, I could still see her tits bouncing. When I was ten, I stuffed my uncle's boots with goat shit. When confronted with my crime, I blamed a squire. Poor boy was flogged and I escaped justice. When I was twelve, I milked my eel into a pot of turtle stew. I flogged the one-eyed snake. I skinned my sausage. I made the bald man cry into the turtle stew, which I do believe my sister ate, at least I hope she did. I once brought a jackass and a honeycomb into a brothel. Silence! What happened next? What do you think you're doing? Confessing my crimes. What is it? What do you want? You're sleeping through the war. What? They stole the Knights March on us. They're a mile north. Get my squire! You don't have a squire! If I die... Weep for me. You'll be dead. How will you know? <laughs> I'll know. Stay low. Stay low. If you're lucky, no one will notice you. I was born lucky. Tribesmen of the Vale! Gather round! Stone Crows! Black Ears! Burn Men! Moon Brothers! And Painted Dogs! Your dominion over the Vale begins now! Onward! Claim what is yours! Pass back! Pass back! Pass back! Pass back! Pass back! Pass back!